course, that's always a fear of mine that I'm gonna put all this work into it and they're just not going to like it. It kind of puts you in a vulnerable position. <laughs> hey, how are you? And I found that even though it, is, it causes major anxiety, there is a lot of reward to doing it. Jordan, this is Modern Goldsmith, and welcome to MGTV's Extreme Jewelry Makeover. In this series, I recycle old jewelry and turn it into something new. Watch this episode in full, leave a comment, and I'll owe you a basket of fries. Today we're taking jewelry from both sides of the family and combining it into one cluster diamond engagement ring. Recycling old jewelry is pretty much the most sustainable way to do things. They want to use diamonds from each piece of jewelry and put it in the new cluster ring. There's going to be some diamonds left over as well as old gold, so that either gets returned to the client or melted down and recycled further. Let's see what this ring design looks like rendered, which is always the fun part. Um, I'm liking it a lot. We're gonna export it as an STL file. Let's go ahead and pick out a name for our file. How about like and subscribe? This is a 3D printer that I bought earlier in 2020. It's called the Asiga 3... Wait. No, it's called the Asiga Max, and um, I'm gonna be doing a video on it actually in the future. But this is the build platform, which lowers itself down into this resin tray. And basically what happens is the model will build itself layer by layer as it raises up. At this point, I'm going to add investment to the flask and I'll definitely want to wear a respirator for this part. Yeah, I always get nervous when um, it's time to reveal the casting. I so always get those little butterflies in my stomach. Reason being is if the casting didn't turn out for any reason, I have to start all over again, which is basically a brand new um, 3D wax, um, investing, burning it out in the oven, 
and then casting again. So I basically have to do everything all over again. So this is always the moment of truth. Lost it, which means I get to go fishing. Yes! Oh man, no matter how many times I do this, I still always get that thrill and that joy and that excitement every time I see that the casting turned out. And when I mean turned out, I mean that the gold filled all the way through the ring. Sometimes if it doesn't fill all the way, you'll get an incomplete casting. Yeah, so this is a tumbler. Basically what it does is there's a lot of little tiny magnetic pins. And basically all these little pins are going The little pins are just polishing up the, uh, the ring for me. Hi. <laughs> hey, how are you? Oh, I'm great. How are you guys? Good, good. Thank you so much for agreeing to even do this. Yeah, of course. <laughs> Alright, ready to go? Let's do it. Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> it's so beautiful. It's everything it's perfect, everything yeah. we wanted. And really it was about making something that merged the two families together and yeah. I think it's perfect. <laughs> perfect, perfect. Alright, so the city um, decided to restore this jewelry sign even though this company went out of business. So I thought who better to use it in a video than me. 